Hello, InnerTubers! Welcome to Granny's Cooking School 101, How to Boil Water. I just finished my cookbook. Now that cookbook is due out in September 2018. So if you're watching this after that, then you were already lucky. It's Granny Potty Mouth's Fast as Fuck Cookbook. And I passed it by a few friends, some of whom were basic amateur cooks, and there were a few things they didn't quite understand. One of them was how to boil water. How hard do you boil water? What does a medium boil mean and what does a simmer mean? Okay, here we go. What I've laid out here are two sizes of pans, a one quart and perhaps a two or three quart. Size really does matter. And I've also laid out some measure cups. And the reason I did that is because people have given me shit in some of my videos because I used a liquid measure cup to measure flour. Well, as you'll see in just a little bit, a cup is a cup the world around. Why do I use a liquid measure cup for something that's dry? Because it's lightweight and my hands are old. Give me a break, fuckers. So the reason this is a little bit difficult is that when you're measuring something dry, it's full to the brim and you smooth it off with a knife. So these things are full to the brim. There you go. Two cups right on the dot. Now let's say you're going to cook up some rice and the water needs to boil first. How do you decide what size pan to use? This shit swells up to twice its size. Don't underestimate how big of a pan you need. It's like a lot of things in life, my dear. When in doubt, go bigger or you'll have a big fucking mess. If you have ever boiled over a pan of rice or pasta, you know exactly what I mean. If I'm going to cook rice and it calls for two cups of water and two cups of rice, would I put it in a pan that's only barely bigger than the amount of water? No fucking way. That's when you go big. Look at there. Plenty of room. I'm going to pour this two cups of water in here and you'll see exactly how much room we have left over. It looks like it barely fills up the bottom. But guess what? That's all the more space for the heat to hit the water. Something else that's really important. Make sure that you buy pans that have lids that fit well. If you can only afford one, buy the bigger one. You know, if people did this on New Year's Eve, instead of shooting off fucking fireworks, everybody would be so much happier. I'm a big fan of a gas stove because you can tell right away whether the heat is high or medium or low. I know not everybody has gas, so use your range the way you like. There's an old wives tale that a watched pot never boils, so we won't. Adding a little salt to the water will help it boil faster. That's science, fuckers. So we're beginning to get a few bubbles. They're beginning to move. Siri, what is the boiling point of water in Fahrenheit? The answer is about 212 degrees Fahrenheit. Let's turn this fucker way up and you can watch it boil hard. So now you throw the rice in. You stir it around according to the directions. Put a lid on it. Like when you're going to say something naughty to somebody or mean and leave it covered. At very low heat, fluffy rice. Look at there. Just for shits and giggles, I'm gonna spoon this shit into the little pan and you'll see what a mess we would have had. Now I'll admit that this does barely fit in the pan. If you'd had any sort of boil over at all, you'd have a fucking mess to clean up. Why would you do this when you can put extra shit in the same pan and only wash one? That's it, intertubers. Boiling Water 101. Pretty fucking simple, right? Again, I want to thank Tiny Sponsor for making these videos possible. They have paid for the editors, which makes my life so much easier and I get to do more videos. If you are a creator and you think someone could sponsor what you're doing, hook up with Tiny Sponsor. It's the kind of hookup that's a good one. Of course, I want to thank all my Patreon pledgers because without you, I just couldn't do what I'm doing. I couldn't. And I'm really grateful for you. If you haven't checked out my Patreon, you be sure to do that. There's words up here and there's a link down below in the description. Follow on the Facebook, subscribe on the YouTube, and that's it for commercial. I love you. Granny loves you. People say I cuss too much. But I